everyone, welcome back to another Counterside video. So today's video, we're tackling Nervier and this week's version of her boss stage in Danger Close. Okay, so let's start off with discussing um, the team that I actually built specifically for the stage. This stage is pretty much very <laughs> kind of difficult because of the debuffs. We'll be, you know, we'll be talking uh, about that later. But before that, uh, let's start with the units that I brought. First is going to be Yuna. So you might have, you know, seen the gear. It's not going to be CDR gear. So I actually chose to give her um, HP sets because she will be your pseudo tank. Yes, you heard me. She's going to tank for us uh, in this game. Um, more or less, she is actually replacing Regina, which is supposedly the lead tank for for this um, boss next would be going to be Edel so Edel is actually here for the same role as uh, for this boss so she is going to have CDR sets and her her role here is to push um, spawn minions and push um, ground uh, in terms of uh, the enemies marching toward you next is going to be Evelyn Sorry, went out. Evelyn here is going to be again supporting your tanks, your especially Yuna, because again she needs to survive for you to push onwards. Um, Yuna again may go may, may go back to Yuna. Yuna actually deals more damage than um, than Regina because she is a striker, and uh, strikers actually are anti rangers, more damage to rangers. So that is why I chose her. So again. Uh, Evelyn is here for healing. The next would be Rosaria. Rosaria is going to play a big part because of the debuff later that we're going to discuss. Um, she is going to have uh, attack speed set uh, because I wanted to deal constant uh, damage uh, with her in play. Next would be Chifuyu. So Chifuyu is here because again she's a striker, she's a solid striker with evasion, and also she gives a debuff to defense of the boss. Next would be uh where's our guest here? Okay, Janus a newcomer to to what they call this to counter side Southeast Asia is going to be used definitely because he's flying. Take note. I've equipped a lot of flying units, so that is, that will come into play later in the buff. So he's here to deal damage as well, and a CDR set is actually good for him. Uh, next is going to be Young Harim. So Young Harim is going to be in charge of more or less your you know your cooldown um, skill haste. Um, that is why it's okay that Yuna is in all HP set because I also have a young Harim here. Then the last one would be Shinja. Okay, not this Shinja. Other Shinja that I have. Where is Shinja? Here you go. Shinja will also be in CDR set. So she's the last piece to be here. And she provides buffs to the team as well. Okay, one um, the other considerations that you might want to put in would be Seun and Regina. You might want to use Regina, but again, for this stage, you're gonna have to find a lot of damage to deal to the boss for you to get a lot of points. The, the other one that you can actually consider is also Maria. Um, I wanted to bring in Maria, but I don't know who to take out. Um, at that point so more or less I left Maria out probably I'll try a different version where I incorporate Maria probably have another go at that and you know present it to you guys okay but before that let's go back a bit um, so as you can see here this is actually again the team that I um, that I assembled so in terms of deployment the deployment sequence that is going to be it because the deployment will play off your operator, which is going to be uh, Yuna. Then the next would be Rosaria and Chifuyu to activate your operator. And also, um, Enterprise is coming into play because it gives your team additional hit percentage, which is, I think, 25%. 
So that is why the best ship for this stage is going to be Enterprise. So again, this stage is actually um, can be autoed, but again, the sequence should be more or less acceptable to you. This one is acceptable to me in terms of survivability, in terms of DPS, and more or less overall performance. So let's check out the video itself or the battle itself. So I'm just going to give my commentary here. So again, Yuna is going to be your pseudo tank. She is uh, juiced up with HP. She has Rayleigh with her to again give her additional HP. But again, Evelyn is there to provide you, her with additional HP again so that she could tank the front row. And you have their Edel at the back. Then you have Rosaria as your Ranger, which is flying, which is not affected by the minus 90% hit. Then you have an additional tank, which is Nanahara Chifuyu, which has a buff for this stage. So she will also tank for you guys. So you don't need, basically, you, you won't be needing um, Regina for this one. This is going to be sufficient. The only problem that you actually have to deal with is the damage to the boss. Because again, your ground units here are, aren't going to hit that much. So I've tried also adding additional air units. Like for example, I tried to add um, Buzzard, but it didn't work that much. So in my assessment of this one, the only... the the cherry on top of this team would be Maria. Because Maria will be summoning a lot of air units and ground units. But the question is, which one will I be taking out of this team comp? Because again, I think Maria is going to be the, the clincher here. But this team is actually stacked already. And the synergy of this team is going to be good. Um, as you can see there, um, Janus hasn't landed, so it hasn't turned into a defender. So we like him as a ranger. But again, um, you still lack that last mile for DPS. As you can see here, I already reached 8,000. Um, more or less at 20, at 20 seconds, this is not going to be enough. So... I actually was near 9,000 when I was about to finish this. But again, it wasn't, you know, uh, enough to get over the finish line. But again, 8,000 is really good. So again, guys, you are not really expected to finish um, or to kill the boss every time you go through um, Danger Close. Get the highest score as possible, preferably nearing 8,000 or 8,000 up. So anyway, guys, thank you for staying this far in this video. Um, I hope this was informative and I hope that I did help you in your gameplay for this week's version of Nervier. And please do consider subscribing. Click that bell icon and put a like to this video. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Take care. Stay safe. This is The Warden and I'm out of here.